Good evening, guys. Nicholas Sai here, and welcome to the Nicholas Sai Show. You know what? If you guys watched the Oscars last night, it is unbelievable, guys. Like, do you know after some of these good peep actors and actresses win an Oscar for one of these different movies that came out? <clears throat> Excuse me. So, this is my reaction called a mix-up at the Oscars reaction. So, here's when it all started. Why is it that every freaking time there is a big night at the Oscars? You've seen some of these good people win for Best Actor. You've seen winning the award for Best Actress because you shout to Emma Stone, though, because she did win an Oscar for La La Land by presented by the great Leonardo DiCaprio from last night because he did win an Oscar last year. It could be from costume designers. It could be everything. For, for the most of these famous people made the right decisions. So, here's when it all started. And guys, it's all over the news, it's all over Twitter, everything on the internet, and these people made some crazy, all around the world made a huge reaction about this. So here's when it all started from last night, during the last, last award for Best Picture. Excuse me, uh, Warren Beatty and that woman, I forgot her name, she showed, he showed up with her. And when I found out, though, they decided to let La La Land to be the winner for Best Picture. But unfortunately, you know what happens. He made a mistake for, for La La Land. You want to know why who's the real winner? It's none other than Moonlight, which also one of the best movies. I mean, Moonlight was a really good movie. You should check this movie out. Are you freaking serious? I mean, come on, dude. You mean to tell me that you made a mistake? By letting La La Land win for Best Picture, but instead it was Moonlight. Really wanted another good movie for Moonlight as well. I'm going to ask you something, guys. Remember back in the day when Steve Harvey was the host of Miss Universe back in the day? It was before this happens this year. Like, either back in 2015 or 2016, I ain't going to lie. They let Miss... When... He announced that it was Columbia who became the winner of Miss Universe. You know, where they come from, from, where, you know, the woman, I forgot her name, the one from Columbia. And when I found out that Steve Harvey made a mistake, he found out that she was the runner-up. So instead, it was Miss Philippines who became the winner of Miss Universe. Because he made a mistake on that, and it was all over Twitter, it was all over the news and stuff. They've been talking about it ever since. Let me, let me tell you something, okay? Why do you realize, let me tell you something. Who paid Warren Beatty to be like this? Because he acted like Steve Harvey when he made a mistake. And Jimmy Kimmel said that he would blame Steve Harvey for this, like what happened before. I mean, congrats to Moonlight, though, because it, it happens to be also one of the best movies. And when after the Oscars was over... Emma Stone made an interview saying that she loves Moonlight. And I agree with that. She said that it was the best picture, which is the best movie ever, because I agree with that. She said that when she was holding an Oscar because she won an Oscar for Best Actress, because I was happy for her. So, let me get this straight, okay? Do you even realize that you made a mistake, Warren Beatty? Why the heck did you do? You did it like Steve Harvey, dude. And that's freaking messed up. Do you know how the heck you do that? It's like, you made a mistake instead of, I mean, instead of La La Land, number one favorite movie to win. The real winner was Moonlight, another second favorite I wanted to go for, because I wanted Moonlight to go for it, or La La Land for best picture. But, you decided to let La La Land win for the best picture, but you, but the real winner was Moonlight. I mean, I was happy for Moonlight. They decided to get another chance for Moonlight anyway, which is cool. Even though La La Land got the most Oscars for winning six in a row, which is incredible. So back to this, man. It's like, I mean, it's crazy. 
They made a huge mistake for doing that stuff. They made a huge mistake of letting, getting the wrong winner. And when that happens, the director of Moonlight, he talks to the people of CNN that I saw in the news earlier today. I mean, it's freaking unbelievable. It's one of the most shocking moments in the history of the Oscars. You know what I'm saying? Because, number one, dude, you know darn well, it's like Steve Harvey all over again. It's unbelievable, dude. It's like the, it's what happens like it, what happened in Miss Universe a while back. I swear, dude, it's like, it's freaking crazy. Got choked just like the Falcons got choked against the Patriots. The Warriors got choked against the Cavaliers last year. And got choked for the Indians against the Chicago Cubs during the World Series. You know what I'm saying? I mean, are you kidding me, Nabai? You made a wrong winner? And I found out that the real winner was Moonlight, another good movie. What the heck was that, though? You know La La Land got the most Oscars, all six of them. I just don't understand what the heck just happened last night. They made a huge mistake, which I really understand that. I mean, huge shout out to Moonlight. Warren Beatty made the wrong decision to know that you do realize when I found out that Emma, that Emma Watson was holding the envelope the whole time. I mean, are you kidding me? That was so freaking messed up, dude. So, their reactions on YouTube, I mean, there is, like, if it happens again next year, in 2018... We need a real host, and even though Jimmy Kimmel was cool, but we need a real host who can make the right decisions for Best Picture next year. Like, another best movie, like the Best Picture. I mean, they better get it right for next year's Oscars, because if it happens again, you know it's going to happen even better. I mean, even worse. So, Warren Beatty, you messed up, dude. Like, you should have done that. That man said that it was a mistake. So I found out from him that it was Moonlight. So, it's unbelievable. It's unbelievable. What the heck was that, though? Who gave the wrong person to win when you know La La Land already won six in a row this year? And they finally got the real winner, which is Moonlight, which they made the right decision. That was a huge mistake for Warren Beatty, dude. Because that's why Moonlight is one of the best movies ever. Which is true, because it's another good movie. With that being said, guys. It was unbelievable. One of the most shocking moments in the history of the 89th Annual Oscars, dude. So, I want to know what your thoughts, people. I mean, it's crazy. It was unbelievable. Why do you even realize that it was a mistake just like what happened in Miss, U Miss Universe a while back? Or like either one or two years ago. I want to know what's going to happen next even though it's still going to be on the news at least. It's, I mean, it was trendy last night for Moonlight or La La Land. But... It's unbelievable, guys. I just don't know what to say. I mean, I feel sorry for La La Land. But congrats to, um, to Moonlight for Best Picture. I mean, they deserve it. I mean, and con a big congrats to Mo La La Land for winning six Oscars, including Emma Watson. She won an Oscar for, um, for, best, fem for best Actress. I mean... They won six in a row, which is incredible. I mean, it's really amazing. If it happens again in the future, guys, it's going to be even worse. So let me know what you guys think down in the comments below. Which is one of the most shocking moments was a mistake from? Was a mistake from Miss Universe or a mistake from the Oscars of 2017? I want to let you know what you guys think down in the comments. Oh, and guys, 
I'm going to look forward for this. Because, guys, if it happens again, like I said, you know what's going to happen. I don't know how you got, they made a mistake for this, for the, for the best picture of the Oscars to let La La Land to go for it. But I found out that the real winner was Moonlight because they made the right decision. So anyways, that concludes my reaction for real. I mean, it's unbelievable for the people who made, for the, for, for, for Warren Beatty to make a mistake, dude. That is unbelievable. Because it's like Steve Harvey all over again. I hope you guys have a happy uh, Monday. And have a good evening guys. And remember. Get the right person to be the real winner of the Oscars. So anyways. Have a good evening guys.